Let's make aloo biryani today. This recipe requires no marination, no curd. You can easily prepare this with the ingredients available at home. So let's get started. Starting with dicing the potatoes. Remember we need big chunks of potatoes. Do not chop them finely. Fry them for a minute. Now add two mirchis, few curry leaves and ginger garlic paste. Saute for a minute or until the raw smell of ginger garlic paste is gone. Now add some spices followed by turmeric, one roughly chopped tomato, chili powder and saute for a minute. Now for replacing the curd we are using the tomato paste. Just simply add two tomatoes and four mirchi into the blender and blend it smooth. Add it into the aloo mixture and fry until the raw smell is gone. Prepare some coriander powder and garam masala powder and keep them aside. Now for cooking the rice we added rock salt, pepper, cloves and cinnamon, two elaichi, two bay leaves, mint and coriander, two slit chilies. Add basmati rice and let it cook for 70%. Meanwhile we'll prepare some fried onions. Just simply slice the onions and fry them until golden and keep them aside. Now add these fried onions into the aloo masala, layer it with the rice, add a layer of freshly chopped coriander and mint, some fried onions on top, sprinkle some coriander powder and garam masala powder, and add a layer of rice, followed by fried onions, add half a slice of lemon juice, I made three holes to make sure the rice cooks evenly. We added some stock that we cooked the rice in and top it up with some fried onions and let it cook for 10 minutes in a low flame and that's it. The aloo biryani is done. Serve and enjoy.